Welcome back to Vicious Attack Llama Apocalypse. And I, I lost twice. So... I wonder if... Um, I wonder if the damage scales... Oh, look. Death is here. Didn't notice that. In Santa Llama. I wonder if the damage scales with uh, more players or if it remains the same. Because this might be difficult because I'm playing alone. Uh, and it might be a game that's meant to play with uh, multiple people. It should scale. Ideally it would scale. Well, I'm not a fan of this water cannon. Did you now? Yeah, I uh, I may not have chosen the best weapon. I can push them away, which is cool, but I don't have enough. I do not have enough uh, firepower to take care of them. I need to destroy mailboxes too. Um, hallelujah. Oh, this game is the best. But I need more firepower. I need... Okay, there, there's a box here. Yeah. This is going to be a lot easier, I think. Also, I just found a sentry bot. Oh, there you go. That's gonna help. Great. Move on. Ice spikes. Okay. Not gonna go with freeze ray. So you can kind of choose where you go next, but every location. Wow, you really aren't good at these challenges, are you? Uh, every location kind of looks the same, so it's fine, but it wasn't necessary. gun is right there like all I if I could complete a mission I would I would level up and I would have much stronger weapons and all that as it is this is a this is a weird difficulty level for level one it may be a false llama, but I think they're regrouping
There's a lot of shooting to be done. The the pistol does get a little redundant. I was kind of hoping that if I took two Contra guns that it would give me a super Contra gun or something, but I don't think that's the case. I really need to uh, to uh, expand upon it outside of the game, I think. Or rather outside of the level. What is this? Oh, homing missile. I don't know how many, I think I had like six or seven hundred people before, I'm, I, I wonder what's my record. Ah! Also, I wonder if I have splash damage from these missiles. I don't think so. It doesn't seem to be the case. Fill me up, 30% chance. And I need to just walk around for a little bit to find some mailboxes. I want that achievement. Two. Oh, there you go. Worth it. Yeah, I know, but I don't... There we go. I need one more mailbox. I don't even know what uh, what accomplishing these goals does. But they're goals, so we have to do them, right? There it is. No, I don't think that's... No. It was blue. I thought this was a mailbox. I don't think there's other mailboxes. So, so dumb. Oh, will you just die? Not interested in the freeze ray. This area that I'm in, it's 
Well, that was a, a llama statue that I just killed. So I love puns, which is surprising, uh, which is uh, not surprising that I would enjoy this game, this full of puns game. I also like gore. There are so many llamas, so many llamas. Um, I really wonder how much this game is going to cost. It does, like, there's not a lot of variety here. Uh, in, in some ways, it reminds me of uh, that bacon game. Uh, bacons and guns or something like that. Which was fun. Uh, it was also just a dollar, so... I wonder if they're taking the same route, or... I don't know. Oh, good. You're done. I'll pack up my bags and we can move on. Okay. Completely forgot that I also had the turret that I can use. I'm looking for some... The mailbox. I just need one mailbox. That's all I need. One small, tiny mailbox. It's bl they're blue. They're very blue. Whoa, what is that? Beauty and the Beast. With a llama. What are your best llama puns? What are what are some puns that should be in this in this game? No, no uh, mailbox. Your way. No, no. So many llamas. How did this all become this? Mailbox. Eh. The engineering department has let me know that they have something special in store for you. I don't know what it is, but I'm, I'm glad. I think the achievements, the uh, complete these things achievements, sticks. So I'm still leveling, leveling up even when I die, I think. So that's good. That's good, because I've died like three times already. While killing llamas with a big giant tank. You know, sometimes... That's just how it goes. You do your best to kill llamas with a big giant tank and uh, sometimes you die. No! I'm taking so much damage and I'm... I'm... There's no way to heal. I wish there was health packs. Uh, it is... It feels unfairly difficult. And um, it feels unfairly difficult 
because I I I feel like this game does not rebalance if you're one, two, three, or four players. Um, and it's also super long. Like I don't know why the first mission is this long, but it probably shouldn't be. Why does it feel like the actress did not know how to, to to say that line? Kill it, kill it with fire. Fine. I uh, in general I do like the actress. Yeah, yeah. Boom. These cars are killing me. I feel like I've get I've received so much more damage from cars than I have from llamas. Probably unlock a way to heal later on. Oh sure, but this I mean this is level one. This should not be I'm not gonna be able to complete level one, I think. Sound the llama. They're coming from all sides. And <laughs> Sound the llama. Sure. Um, this should not be as difficult as it is. And it should not be as long as it is. Yeah. Can I? Did I unlock anything? Can I do stuff? Okay. So I have. So all of the the achievements that I've unlocked do give me more stuff. So I I'm not actually losing anything. Um. I guess the more you kill with specific weapons, the more they level up. So that's that's been happening. Uh, without my my knowledge. So there might only be one level. I'm now realizing that uh, this is this is why it's super difficult because there's only one level. Nope, there's more there's four levels. There's at least four levels. I love the Lamazon logo, by the way. I think that's that's really cool. Welcome. If you want to get some fancy mech upgrades, then you're going to have to do some challenges. I think these are procedurally generated. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but these almost feel procedurally generated. Feels weird to have a blue UI now. I, I switched the color of my of my ship. Did not realize it would change the the UI, which you know I I'm I'm fine with. I'm perfectly fine. But it feels weird to have a blue UI now.
Aiming is not super easy, but that's not that's not a complaint. It's that that one feels pretty much how they wanted the game to play, and uh, I'm not I'm not exactly against it. I mean, like it feels like a fair challenge to overcome to kind of uh, account for the spread in size of between your arms. It's worth playing so for the puns alone. Go for it. All right, there you go. I feel like the uh, the gun that I have should be a little bit better than it is. Uh, the the missiles like they don't track super well uh, I'm guessing that as it levels up it's gonna be a lot more worth it it's just a matter of getting there things I'm now realizing that kind of sucks is that so right now if I use my super I am not going to be able to um, gain kills for my weapons so you're I'm kind of encouraged not to use my super because of that It's not like it's not it's not actually too bad but it is a consideration to keep Just unlock healing finally? I hope so. I could use some healing. Now might be a good time to start spraying bullets. I mean, I'm trying to. These weapons are not exactly made. You know, so I none of my weapons except the rifle that I got once really shoot fast. And I think it's more satisfying to shoot a lot of weak bullets than to shoot one big bullet. Um, I mean, missiles are, are satisfying. They explode and whatnot. You can see things theoretically fly all over the place. Um, I feel like most of these weapons are all very slow and I wish there was more, at least one more fast weapon. Um... Especially since I only saw the rifle once. Maybe I would have a different opinion if I saw the rifle more more often. I didn't like the grenade launcher. I do like Llamas Arabs though. No. There are lots more fast weapons once you unlock them. Yeah. 
It takes a while to unlock them, though. I've been I've been through. Oh, so I I assume that you uh, you made you made the game, uh, considering the fact that you have the 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 name Rogue. Um, so do you? Um, what was the question? I had so many questions. First of all. The game is awesome. Oh, is there is there a reference to Winamp in your game? Because if not, you've missed a golden opportunity. Is there a way to heal? Oh, yeah, that's the question I was going for. Does the game scale according to the number of players? Because right now, it feels like it doesn't. Uh, I'm playing alone, and it really... It feels like it, this was made for four people rather than one. I got all frazzled. The dev of the game is in my stream? No! Also, how much will be the game when, when it launches? I, uh, I don't... I don't know that it was indicated anywhere. Uh, it might have been, but I didn't notice. There we go. Uh, lots of references to lots of things. Yes, yeah, yeah, it scales. Oh, really? Okay, so I can't, I can't imagine how many, uh, how many llamas or how, how much more difficult they are at level, uh, at the higher levels. So, I, I died, this is about my fourth attempt through level one. Do you have an estimate of for the average player, uh, you know, obviously different players, different skill levels, and as the devs, I'm sure you guys play a lot better than me. Um, do you have an estimate of how many times people would go through the first level before they can complete it properly? Is four, le is four times through normal, or am I just p playing really, really bad? All right. Fifteen dollars launches with a fifteen percent discount. Awesome. Like, the cars are what kills me. The llamas are not super deadly. I keep dying because of the cars and because there's no there's no healing, which uh, I think is a little frustrating. Okay. Fat and Furious. Oh, April 3rd? So why April 3rd? Is there... Is there something about April 3rd? How you approach unlocks? Okay. Well, I mean, uh, I've been playing for about an hour now. So I was wondering if I was just doing... It It, it felt like I was doing terrible. Uh, like, I, 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 um, I was kind of expecting more progression. And uh, I, I thought I actually thought I was doing it really, really bad, and uh, I was I was missing something. Also, I do not know what the dumpsters are, what they look like. Also, luck. Yeah, cause the uh, what what you unlock, I guess, is not um, is random. Lama 
I thought I thought it it, it might have been a Lamala day or something like that. Ah. There we go. One thing we destroy as much as you can, it increases the chances of No. Oh, by the way, uh, I believe, yeah, you're, uh, you, you forgot to include, uh, windowed mode, uh, which does exist, uh, because you can do alt enter to do it, but it really should be a button that you, you toggle on and off. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I destroyed the dumpster, but I'm never going to survive this. I guess I can spend a few moments finding uh, dumpsters. Man, I really wish I had um, health. I wish there were health pickups. <laughs> That's not an option. It's a top down game. What did I just get? I saw Larmer, but I didn't gain any health. I thought I had finally found the uh, the mystical health uh, pack, but apparently not. The elusive health pack, I should say. The one I was asking for, I'm busy working on it, just don't want to make yeah. I'm seeing multiple heat yeah. Well, I mean, so full screen does exist. I'm running in full screen. Uh, in uh, sorry, window does exist. I am running in windows right now. Um, it's just a matter of adding the button in the uh, in the menu. Well, yeah, I uh, I totally get it. I don't know how your your menus are built. Uh, those that definitely. That definitely uh, can have an impact. What do you call a big pack of vicious llamas heading your way? I don't know, but you better get ready. I mean, wh when do I have time to do that? Oh. Wait, do I get to choose between these? Oh, I didn't realize I had stats here. Interesting. There aren't health packs that first you get earlier get give you health for the llamas. Yeah.
Ne? Destroy 10 dumpsters is not easy because there's not as many dumpsters as there are cars, for instance. No! Well, I died. You're all active because you got them as drop. I see. Our corporate alignment performance leveraging strategy, it isn't working. Well, um, it's a pretty fun game. I definitely think, uh, like, it, it took a moment to, to wrap my head around uh, a few of the systems, but I think it's it's pretty fun. I, I will not have completed level one, sadly. Um, a few things uh, I, I kind of uh, would have wanted, like uh, like I was saying, Machine guns. I got the machine gun once. I wish I had that more often. Like it's, you know, um, killing llamas is super satisfying, but the shooting the weapons is not super satisfying. And because there's a lot of time, you're always reloading. They're slow. They're, the guns are slow, and the pistol doesn't exactly kill in one shot either. Like it, it it'll level up and all that, and I do get that, but um, I kind of wish that after an hour I had completed level one and the fact that I didn't feels kind of feels unsatisfying for me um, I would like I would what I wish is that I would have completed level one on normal and then there would have been hard extra hard impossible and then uh, those would have spawned more llamas or they would have had more health or something like that something like uh, earth defense force did uh which made the uh, the missions replayable because of that because you always aimed for for more um higher difficulty levels and as you level up your vehicle well those higher difficulty levels become more accessible as well so i mean it's it's an interesting game um i i like uh, i like killing llamas i thought the, i thought the humor was on point by the way I think this didn't work. Glad you could join us at the Lamazon Corporation. Thanks for signing I up think. for humanity. I'm Melissa, your eyes in the sky, and I'll be here with you every step of the way. You're on board the Isn't there a video? LCS50, a warship and mobile arsenal. We're currently docked just offshore of Santa Lama City. We don't have much time to get you up to speed, so listen closely. A rogue group of ex Lamazon employees. Well, I thought there was a video. Oh yeah, it it came just just after that. The video did not play for me when I <coughs> when I tried the video, uh, it didn't play. I just had nothing. Uh, but the video for for your company logo did play though. Uh, so I mean uh, maybe there's there's something missing there, but you know, it's a very small things in the grand scheme of things. Oh. You have a quit button, but you can't access quit with the uh, the the controller. You can't. You also can't quit by pressing B, for instance. Uh, so uh, that that might be a little something to add as well. Small, very very min uh, minute things. I I thought the game was overall uh, really fun. Uh, encourage people to go check it out. We now know the price. It's going to be fifteen dollars. Released tomorrow. Huge thanks to rogue code a bug with OBS streaming at the same time okay well there you go yeah and that those those things happen uh, as a dev I can tell you I totally get it so um, $15 go check it out um, by rogue code uh, huge thanks to the key that you guys provided to me through key mailer that's going to be it for me for uh, vicious attack llama apocalypse 
My name is Kevin Jaguar. I'll talk to you guys next game. Peace out. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. You know the drill. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check out some games I've made, like Arrow Light Core. Alright, until next time, peace out!